Uh, but yeah, so Nick went ahead and around this time went ahead and he streams. Well, he didn't stream tonight, but he appeared on a friend, potentially criminal stream. He went ahead and I guess he was trying to flex. He was trying to do some weird kind of flex. Um, but nonetheless, he was hate watching Sean because I don't know. I guess Nick has nothing better to do. Uh, but let's let's play this. Real quick. A hundred K to shut up. Would you take it? I would. F Are you fucking kidding me? For a hundred fucking thousand dollars. Nick comes up. Nick comes up to me. And my fucking porch dumps out a hundred bands. It says, take it. You'll shut up. Oh my God. I'd have lips like a fucking statue. Are you kidding me? A hundred fucking thousand dollars. Yes. I mean, like, are you fucking kidding me? Hell yeah, I'll do it. I don't think he's got that kind of scratch on him right now, though. <laughs> oh, you don't say. Yeah, I mean, where could that have gone, Chad? I think that went to the. Uh, I think that went to the. The. Uh, 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 Coke fund. <laughs> Let's see what's going on here. Oh, I think you're bullshitting me. On. If Let's he see. showed up, he showed up with a hundred G's. You'd slap me if I didn't take it. Five hundred K minimum. All right. Ricada Law for one hundred dollars. Oh, so Nick can't afford the hundred K, probably because it all went to his fucking, you know, his funds, uh, his uh, his Coke funds. But but he did give uh Sean a hundred dollars, and then he says, "I'd rather open a new Jimmy John's in town." So Nick only coming in with the most fire of roasts. All right. Thank you for your support. I would rather open a new Jimmy John's in town. So a uh, fucking Ricada seething in Sean's chat and shit. And also, I, I was there. He was getting destroyed by the <laughs> For those of you that thought that this was Ricada, this was not the flex you thought it was. You were getting fucking eaten alive in the chat, bro. I'm gonna be fucking honest with you. Uh and I think you need that money right now. Although, although Nick was born with a silver spoon in his mouth and he is a trust fund kid, I heard. Um, so maybe he has money to spend, you know, that's fun. Well, there's already like, there's more than one in town already. I think you're going to be kind of hurting on your, uh, you're going to be hurting on your, uh, you know, franchise contract there. But yes, a hundred dollars to make a sandwich joke. Hmm. I mean, could at least have done a Denny's joke there, bud. <laughs> I don't know, man. Think about it. Like. You're getting fucking made fun of uh, by a better lawyer, right? A better lawyer like Sean is just destroying you. He's standing you up, right? Uh, and you just, your response to it is to bend over. Like, Nick, I already know you're a cuckold, but like, God, please have some dignity left, my man. Like, what are you doing, right? Like, I don't know, man. I think, here's what I think. I think Nick actually thought he looked cool. <laughs> he did this. He was like, yeah, I'm going to flex that hundred dollars on Sean right now. Sean! Sean, you don't understand, Sean! <laughs> and then Ricada proceeds to spur out on a bunch of randoms. Like, I don't I don't get the moves. Uh, that's kind of why I had, to, I had to title this, like, Manic Meltdown. Because it kind of is. Like, th none of this shit makes sense. Maybe he's, maybe he's sniffing a couple lines here and there. I don't know. Maybe he switched to edibles or some shit. Maybe that's why he's more chill. I, I, who knows? Who knows? Who knows what the nose knows? All right. Try saying that three times. Could have done a Denny's joke for $100. But I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Yeah. Also, by the way, Nick, since you're here, I know you got copies of Discovery. So you have the body cam with you, homie. Oh, you oh, we should share it. Oh, oh, <laughs> put it up. Let's watch it. Oh, shit. I mean, you really think you're going to get in trouble for watching it and sharing it? Oh, you know, shit. you're not. Just come on, share it. Share it with the class. Oh, shit. I know you got it. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. You could do it. <laughs> Leaks happen all the time, man. Oh, my God. Oh, I that's good. That's good. Look, man. Like when I said when I said Sean was cooking Nick, I was not joking. Holy fucking shit! That's good. That's Chef's kiss right there. I did get a shower text. Chef's kiss. I did get a shower text. <laughs> Infamous shower text from Nick. 
Refund me who? Aww. Aww. Nick says the silly thing is that actually. Oh my do a god. Bro, wait a minute. Okay, so he's actually giving. <laughs> Wait a minute, bro. Okay, I know, I know. Fucking, uh, I'm not okay. Chat. All right, I'm no. I know I'm out of. Ch uh, I'm out of touch. Okay, I know. I get it. I don't understand how these, how this works on the interwebs anymore. Okay, but like, why the fuck is this guy still giving him? <laughs> like Nick, you understand? You could just like you have a wrench, man. People are gonna know this is the real Ricada law. You could just say something. All right, you don't have to keep giving this guy money. Right? It's just not the flex. And now we know you're fucking broke because you gave him 10... Look, Nick, if you really wanted the flex, you're going to give him Sean like $500 that night. Just that $10 super chat could have been 100 Okay? You could have been flexing like anytime. You fucking... You just expose yourself as a broke fucking bitch because you went from... I don't, I don't know, Nick. Do you wonder why we haven't? Well, I mean, considering there's like... 14 hours and like 900 miles is one of the issues, but one of the other ones is I think you need to get your shit in order before I'd even want to sit down with you, and you really need to work on that. You you got a lot of things you need to do out there, Hoss. Elsa, do you remember the last time fucking Sean and Nick tried to talk? You remember how Nick berated this guy over and over and over again for simply asking a question? I remember that. Fucking Kiwi Farms remembers that. Elisa has it on her channel. We laugh at it all the time because Nick had a literal fucking meltdown over Sean asking one fucking question, ranted about it for like 20 fucking minutes, berated Sean over and over and over and over again, right? It's He was coming up with like weird conspiracies about how Sean needs the Kiwi Farms and stuff. Like, what the fuck, dude? Like, that's maybe that's why he doesn't want to have lunch with you, man. Like, I don't know. A lot of them. What? Nick, you're going to run out of hot water, buddy. Mm hmm. Okay. I mean, yeah. Me and you did talk before. Mm hmm. I, I don't know what your. You know, things change, dude. Why the fuck is Nick sending shower texts to Sean, dude? What the fuck is happening right now? I don't get it. I don't get this 50D chess move, chat. Is this like another Dr. Disrespect 50D chess move? I just, I can't pick up on it. I don't understand it. Like, <laughs> I don't know. Nick, Nick is making a comeback, guys. He's, he's working all of us. You fucking cheese slid off your cracker and you did a bunch of bad shit. Like, you know, there ain't no loyalty else here, my Fuhrer. I don't know what to tell you. I'm not sworn a blood oath to you. Oh, and there's not to the father. There, there's there's Nick again with the blood oaths and shit, or like say like I I hate the idea. This is how you know Nick is a fucking A class narcissist, very full of himself. It always comes back to like you owe him something, but he t he acts as if he's your friend. So he'll he'll be like. Sean, we're friends. No, oh, hold on. Sean, we're friends, okay? But you owe me your loyalty. Andrew, we're friends, but you owe me your loyalty. Flash, we're friends, but you owe... Like, it, it always ha... And I know Nick tries to deflect and act like it doesn't, and everybody... It's everybody else's fault. It's never Nick's. It's always to Nick. It's Sean's fault. It's Legal Mindset's fault. It's Flash's fault. You know, I get it. I get it. But, like, uh oh, fuck, Nick. This is, like... You do this too often. Okay, you do this too often, too soon. And it's not good, because then you end up looking like a Riri, and fucking Sean puts you in your place. Lawyers like Sean. Whether it's Sean, Legal Mindset, or even fucking Flash. Other land. Won't be the guy in the homeless people. Nick, I, listen, I appreciate that. I understand you're trying to talk me off a ledge here, buddy. <laughs> I'll survive. I'm promise. I'll survive this. What the fuck is Nick doing, chat? Okay, chat. All right, let's play. What do you fucking think he's sending uh, what, Sean in, in those fucking shower texts? What could be in those shower texts? The hell is he saying to him? Uh, D Jack Murphy's mutuals, a lot nasally than that. Sent. I'll try. Listen, I'll try to work on the Baldo, uh, the Baldo impression. All right. It's going to fucking kill me, but I'll try it. What do you think is in those shower texts, though? Oh, fuck. Imagine getting bodied by lawyer Santa. <laughs> yes. Why won't you pick up the broom shot? Wait, hold on. I got, okay, this one I got to do in Nick's impression. Hold on. 
Why won't you pick up the broom, Sean? Why? Please, Sean. Please. I'm running out of hot water here, Sean. <laughs> How's that for nasally? <laughs> um, I like how Nick instantly started texting Sean like a total control freak. Continue to cope and seed, Rakeda. Yeah, that's another thing, right? He went from like... He went from trying to flex on the internet to like a bunch of people and Sean's chat and giving like trying to make a power move or something. Then Rakeda realized he like spent more than he should have. Like he's a broke bitch or he's becoming a broke bitch. So he lost um a hundred dollars. Then he's like, oh fuck, I still want to flex. He gave him ten dollars and then he had to reduce himself to shower text. <laughs> okay. Let's see. You know he's doing a chargeback after the stream, the bum. Yeah, Nick would be the type to do chargebacks. Uh, the best was when someone chatted to, to say Kayla would prefer five guys. Yeah. <laughs> yes, she would. Uh, Nick said he doesn't watch regarded law to or retarded law to. See, I'll say it here, okay? Nick said he doesn't watch retarded law tubers. The ending is absolute gold. Oh, well, looks like we're gonna have to watch the ending, pal. Well, let's see what's what happens at the ending. Because if this all goes away, I'll go back to doing my thing and I'll move on with my life. So, like, don't understand what you're trying to do here, man. Don't understand. What's he saying? Is fucking, yeah, I actually want to know now. Is Nick, like, threatening this guy? What the fuck is he doing? Dang. Well, I don't... Uh, here's the neat thing, Dennis. Unlike other people, I don't fucking publish that shit. I don't do that. That's not how I fucking roll. I also don't disclose what people give to me in times of crisis. Yeah, you remember how Nick fucking leaked Noel's messages with him when he reached out to Noel like a fucking rat? And he tried to craft his own narrative about it and shit. Like, this was around, like, Nick's desperate stages. Like, I don't think Nick would ever do... Like, if you talk about Nick from 2020... Fuck, I want to say even 2021 or so. I don't think... I think this went against his code, right? I don't think he would... He'd ever do that, right? And this was that he was preaching and stuff like that. But then he just goes back on it. After being the one that antagonizes Null and goes ahead. And he's the one that actively seeking fucking josh and kiwi farms and trying to make josh the proxy for talking on the farms it's so it's fucking weird and then nick goes out of his way to publish all the messages and shit so i'm guessing maybe that's what sean's referencing here because i don't do that shit either i maintain confidence so no i'll never tell is nick's texting gay shit at me yes <laughs> Uh, Nick got offended by the he doesn't have that kind of scratch now comment and chatted a hundred dollars is a flex. Oh, oh, okay, that makes more sense. I was like, why the fuck would is he just what prompted this? Of course, it was like he doesn't have that kind of scratch. Okay, Nick, Nick, Nick's ego, of course. Uh, uh, let's see. Lol, at least Sean is honest. If he gave me a hundred k and told me to shut the fuck up, I'd probably do the same. Except for Ralph, of course, of course. What's sad is that Sean is probably Nick's best friend right now, and Nick doesn't even realize it. The best part was whoever made the Five Guys joke <laughs> in response to Nick's Jimmy John statement. Remember, Nick doesn't watch what other people are saying about... Yeah, I mean, that's another thing I kind of have to wonder, right? Why the... How the... Okay, how and why the fuck is Nick here, right? Why is he in Sean's chat, right? Because doesn't he... Nick always says, oh, I don't I don't care about what people say about me. I'm above this, blah, blah, blah. Now, granted, you know, when he fights with all these, like, random fucking Twitter accounts that aren't don't even really have an internet presence, should be able to tell that that's bullshit. But even still, like, how the hell is he coming up to fucking Sean's stream, just casually saying, oh, Sean, it's not like that, Sean. Sean, I have $100 to spare. I have that kind of scratch, Sean. Like, what the fuck is this? It's freaking insane. And yeah, to that one comment that said that Sean is probably Nick's best friend right now. Yeah, that's pretty probably what it is, too. Like, because Nick has burned every fucking bridge in the book, right? He's got some of the Baldo guards. But you know what, chat? I'm willing to bet that at some point, 
they're probably going to drop the brooms. I don't think it's going to last forever. Um, that's what I think. That's that's my prediction. I predict that eventually we're going to see people like Kumalot put the broom down. Melanie Max going to put the broom down. Uh, it is. It's just yeah. It's a, just a deteriorating uh, human being we're seeing right now. 